It's a g gamma, gamma minus. What's up, guys? This is Dandry bringing you another part of my Nuzlocke randomizer of Fire Red. And right here, we're jumping right into the middle of a battle with the gym leader, Brock. And you're wondering, why the fuck would I want to start a video at the beginning with the gym leader? Well, I had a beginning, but as I was saying, I'm trying to get the video process down to a point where it's it's ne next next to perfect. And uh, I fucking, what, for whatever reason, the video at the beginning just fucked up. And this is where it started. It ends perfectly. But basically, I did some off-screen training. And Bubbly completely annihilated the entire gym, winning us the boulder badge and the TM. Uh, so that's all good. Uh, Bubbly w was up to level uh, 15. He grew a level 16 in this battle. And Chiba is at 15, as well as Mr. Kitty, who's at its highest level right now, is 17. And yeah, all is good right now. So we're just going to get our items from Brock. And mosey on our way. Uh, I was just gonna do a video just of the gym, but then I realized, oh fuck, I like overtrained way too much. So I, I'm just gonna lay off a little bit. I, actually, I can take her easy for the next little bit of the game because of all the training I did before. And uh, yeah, I had this big intro plan. I was gonna say how much training I did and how strong everyone got. <laughs> and fuck, I fucked it. So I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry about that. Heading to the mart and gonna pick up uh, just some Pokeballs and some items here. Okay, so let's get the fuck out of here. And I believe we're also going to be on a new route too, aren't we? If I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's just heal up right quick. Before we venture in, there's a few trainers there. We don't want to get too overwhelmed. We don't want to get ahead of ourselves. We don't get too cocky when the element of death is introduced <laughs> to the Pokemon world. Because um, if one of my Pokemon faints, that's it. They're fucking done. And I'm gonna have to catch some reserves here. Man, it's so fucking slow walking. Oh, what does this guy want? Oh! Just in time. <laughs> I was wondering why I hadn't gotten them yet. That would be like me to leave home without my running shoes. Oh, <laughs> sent by my mom. Oh, Mama Landry. Yeah, so root three and yeah check them out we're just gonna switch up put Chiba in the front we're gonna try and pick it up to the same par as the others it's gonna suck for the next Pokemon I catch because um, the other three are such a high level I'm gonna rely on them a lot more but this ain't our first rodeo folks Pidgey uh, I'm not scared of this Pidgey I'm level 15 uh, it's probably just going to sand attack me to death. So I'm going to put it to sleep. And proceed to leech seed it, I believe. Yep. Now this thing's asleep. And it wakes up. Must have early bird or something. I don't know. And it sand attacks me, as I predicted. Good predict. a little bit of health and I'm just gonna switch out here just because I have a feeling that a flying moves coming not that I watched this beforehand though <laughs> but it was a good predict on my part just to bring out mr. kitty uh, and surprisingly I can scratch this with a stab and admin nature and fucking take it down fucking level 17 might have something to do with that too but whatever we're gonna stay in with mr. kitty just to get this battle over with I'm going to scratch it, one shot this Pidgey. Fucking mosey along. Um, I'll try, uh, I'll, I'll try a little bit harder next time to, um, I'm going to play around with the video options again, see what comes out for the part, <laughs> for part five. 
the actual part five. Um, so we're gonna battle this guy here. He saw me in Viridian Forest and he beat me here. Seems Buddy only stops uh, people who uh, he feels are gonna actually challenge the gym instead of bug catcher or what's his face here. And I'm not scared of this Caterpie. It, does, it definitely doesn't know a bug move just outside of string shot. And tackle's not gonna do shit to me. So we're gonna stay in. We're gonna vine whip it. Probably two shot it? No, three shot. That's terrible. But that's the price you pay for good defense. With a bold nature. Okay, we're gonna kill the Caterpie. Caterpie! Chiba gets a little bit of experience. He's gonna send in a Weedle. I'm gonna stay in. And then I'm going to switch it up right quick just for the experience. Switch to Bubbly, get him in there, stretch some technicals. Technicals, testicles, tentacles. There we go. <laughs> and this Weedle is going to use the Catapri method and string shot me to death. Um, I'm going to water gun it and kill it, I think. Yep. <laughs> it's funny bug types aren't weak to water considering most times if you drop a bug in water they're fucking screwed <laughs> we're gonna one shot the catapri catapri <laughs> I like saying that <laughs> catapri alright let's Oh, this is the famous, he likes his shorts, they're comfy and easy to wear. Good for you. <laughs> oh, nice. A ratata. Level 11, I'll get some experience off this. Let's try and poison it. Oh, motherfucker. It's gonna tail whip me. Not scared of that. I'm just gonna vine whip now, just to... <laughs> I mean, it's funny you just don't go for the... E I think more tactically now, since I've been paying attention to like the online battles and stuff. And before, I mean, I, I mean, when you're a kid, I just think to myself, all attack moves, just keep attacking. Like, why bother waste a turn doing anything else when you can attack and get its health down? And it's such a stupid, like, offensive-minded way to think. But I mean, it works through the story mode. You just attack your way through the game. But the developers have done a good job since the beginning just to make like uh, more of a challenge for you. I know I wasn't expecting a surf from that Hydrogen at the end of Pokemon Black. And I haven't played Black 2 yet. Ooh, spoiler, maybe my next playthrough. <laughs> Alright, we're going to battle with Sally. She's going to send out Ratata. Ratatata. I only have five vine whip left. So we're gonna use Bleach Seed here and get some health back, because it's probably a good idea, even though it has like no health left, but little to no health doesn't matter. It's gonna put me back in the green. And then I'm gonna vine whip it for the kill. And nice, Chiba grows level 16, and I believe that's a special level for Chiba. We'll see after this battle. Alright, Nidoran comes out. I'm gonna water gun it to death. One shot. Oh no, not a one shot. It growls me. It lived with like 1 HP. Motherfucker. Motherfucker Nidoran. Bubbly gets a little bit of experience in there. We defeat the lady. Oh, and what's this? Chiba is evolving. Nice. Our first evolution. Uh huh. And we now have an Ivysaur. Sweet. I enjoy Ivysaur. 
one of my faves. I'm very biased to Gen 1 pokes. Because <laughs> that's just the ones I grew up with. So we're going to heal Chiba, and then I believe we're going to call it quits there, folks. So I'll see you next time. Don't forget to do the following. Peace!